Hey, hi guys, welcome to PCF. Okay. In this video, we are going to discuss about the Azure DevOps. What is Azure DevOps? Who can learn the Azure DevOps? Okay, so what is Azure DevOps? Okay, what is DevOps? First, we'll discuss what is DevOps and who need, what is the need of DevOps? Okay, what is the need of DevOps and who should learn the DevOps? Okay, so what are the benefits of DevOps? Okay, in this video, you will come to know these points, guys. Okay, these points. Okay. Now, before going to learn what is DevOps means, okay, so if you go to the before DevOps, okay, what is the SDLC, okay, SDLC means software development life cycle, how software development life cycle will work, okay, so first they will plan, okay, first they will plan and then code, okay, so and then code, and then after they will build, okay, test, deploy, okay, operate and monitor, okay, operator and monitor. Okay, these are the things we have uh, in SDLs. Okay, software development life cycle. Okay, so but in small company, okay, single team can do that. Okay, but in very big company, so we have a uh, different teams. Okay, so plan will do the different team, business team will do. Okay, business team or product owner can do that plan, but code and build and test will do the developer team. Okay, code, build and test. Okay, this will do by what so developer team okay so testing also testers will come in the developer team guys okay developer developer can do that okay developer can do this okay but deploy and operate and monitor okay deploy operator and monitor can do the operation team okay so this can do the operation team guys okay operation team operation team okay operation team can do that okay so but so what so you understand the sdlc right so these these three teams can do these things okay planning and development and then deploy and operate and monitor okay three teams one is a business team and then second one is development team and then operation team okay this team okay these all are includes to uh, develop the product okay to develop successful products these three teams will work but what is devops okay why Dev devops is coming to the picture okay why devops coming to the picture okay i will give one example guys okay uh, uh, there is a hotel okay in the hotel is running uh, functioning very well okay functioning very well and then uh, so the hotel manager's son has uh, invented one a good recipe okay he want to uh, um, he want to introduce that recipe in the hotel okay uh, so immediately he went to his father and then uh, he asked to uh, invent this recipe in our hotel he said but what father replied okay so no uh, how uh, this if i introduce this recipe how this is going to be uh, you know uh, function and all even our uh, you know uh, that cookers will may know this recipe they are going to be well cook or not and all so it may not work uh, sometimes so um, i will not in, uh, invent okay so then immediately the sun will hurt right the same way, the same way, developer and operation team, guys. Okay, here developer means a son. Okay, developer means son, and operation means operation means uh, father. Okay, so whenever developer invent something and then try to push that into the production, okay, operation team always reject that. Always reject that. So that is the reason. Okay, so to uh, and also whenever uh, so like developer team uh, okay so whenever developer team develops something and then so it is working in my environment perfectly but it's uh, so like uh, so operation in op whenever it moved to the operation it is not working so there is a blaming game okay there is a blaming game between, between a developer and operation team guys okay so they are blaming each other but so client don't want this all all blaming games and all okay they want a quality products by okay understanding between the teams and all so we should provide some quality information okay for that purpose okay devops come into the picture so everything is in an automated way okay everything is in an automated way so dev so that is the reason for devops comes in picture devops what is devops means so in dev uh, development from development we have taken the dev and from operation team we have taken the apps okay so that is devops okay so that is called devops okay what is the need of devops guys okay what is the need of devops okay devops is a uh, you know devops means devops is not a 
you know software or technology devops is a culture or practice okay practice will have the gaps so just now we discussed about the gaps between the so to fill the gap between a developer and operation team will go for a devops okay so both the teams work together in sdlc ensure the quality of product and ability of product to work uh, dif uh, in a different environments perfectly okay so in a different environments okay so together okay and so which teams development team and the operation team work together and then they have to provide the quality of product and the ability of product to work in a different different environments means here like a dev environment a qa environment and production environment so it should work properly and to automate this process we have a lot of tools okay so we have uh, so to automate uh, so whenever so the code is pushed uh, so code is uh, like developed so it automatically it automatically uh, move to the um, production so to automate this uh, uh, it automatically tested and um, you know build it and it moved to the production so in automated way so we have a lot of tools okay to do that okay so that we will discuss in later okay now devops help us to run the life cycle on each commit okay in particular interval by using automate process okay in each situation okay we can use that and then we can run automatically okay and who should learn this okay who should learn this devops okay each person who is working in the each person who is working in the software development team guys okay so who are working in the uh, software so they all should learn okay that may be developer tester okay product owner scrum master and everyone should learn that operation team okay even operation team also can learn that and the individual developer also should learn that management team also like to like how the uh, product is uh, like so how they are progressing and all even client want to see like how the progressing and all even they should know about the devops and everyone who are related to the development case okay so that uh, this person can learn and what is the benefits of uh, devops okay what is the benefits of devops means like uh, for fast delivery okay so for fast deployment case okay so if you want to deploy the code fast okay deploying the code fast from uh, dev machine to server very fast we can go with the devops okay it will fast development and uh, reduce time okay lot of things case okay for testing and deployment and rollback okay if you want to roll back so earlier we have to go with the client i also this is not working and then i want to roll back the data so it's it so there is a lot of things to uh, like uh, so manual work is reduced okay so lot of manual reduce okay so we are doing everything automated right so uh, the testing and deployment and rollback everything will be happening in automatic uh, automatically okay so roll back uh, roll back just now we discussed right and the quality okay so if the humans are checking the quality that may be okay the quality may not be good but so it's a machine is checking the quality and all so right so before deploying to the server so that is the reason the quality also good and the collaboration okay between the teams okay so teams collaborate um, in uh, together and then they built a great product and easy to use okay very easy okay to uh, use the develop uh, devops it's a very easy to use and no maintenance okay uh, and secure and reliable uh, reliable also okay so that is the about the um, so who can learn and all so in the next video so like um, next video what is azure devops and the relationship between the azure and devops okay so what is azure services we have what are the azure services we have and what is the azure devops server and what is the difference between uh, vsts and azure devops okay that we will discuss in the next video guys okay thank you so hope you understand that okay thank you